Ah, it's you. Saigo has sent word back that he's ready to negotiate. In truth, I already had high hopes. But you still outdone yourself. Princess Atsuko, Saigo, and I, we could never have achieved this, no matter how hard we tried. The fact that we've been able to come this far is all down to the bonds that you have forged. Ah, a little dig at me now, huh? Well, I apologize for the mess I dragged you into. But there's no harm in embracing life's chance encounters. True, maintaining bonds can be tough, but it's worth it in the end. I want to settle things between the Shogunate and the new administration. We need less fighting and more talking. It won't be easy, but what choice is there? But I fear the Demon Claw Samurai is bound to intervene. That's why I want you there, to end this once and for all. Right. It's do or die for the both of us tonight. By the way, some of your acquaintances are hoping for a word with you. The negotiations with Psycho aren't set to begin just yet. I'm sure you have much to discuss, so I'll leave you be. Have you met with everyone you wanted? When you're ready, head to the Satsuma base. No need to be so stiff. It's the difficult things that end up the most interesting. Never be so uptight, you can't enjoy the moment. Right then, let's go. This is no time for games or evasions. Let us be straight with each other. Naturally, I came with the same intention. So let us talk. First, the new administration's requests. Be the one to kill you!
Nothing proved. <laughs> I wanted to make a world where we could live together. Just let me die. By your hand. People we hated. My only goal in life was to create a nation where we could thrive. And you're telling me to just give up? Hmm. Why not? It's a new dawn for Japan. It could be for you, too. No. I wish to leave this land. I'll watch things unfold from some far-off place. Even if we are apart, still we are one.
The age of the samurai draws to a close. But the samurai spirit lives on, and new horizons await. Following the talks between Kaishu Katsu and Takamori Saigo, the Shogunate forces surrender Edo Castle. With that, those who dreamed of a new dawn for Japan succeed in avoiding full-blown war in Edo, saving countless lives. <laughs>